Yep, I'm going to use logic in a video. The world is ending as we speak. So what I did was, I took a look at some details of Binding of Isaac Rebirth, and then started coming up with conclusions by using too much logic, and I came up with a list that I will share with the internet while screaming like a retard. Mind you, this isn't 100% accurate. It's a prediction. It's not, it's not official or anything. I'll be very surprised when I look back at this video and actually hit bullseye. Also, spoilers. A lot of them. Enjoy. Or don't. I don't care. According to the game's creator, Ed McMillan, he has said that in Rebirth there is going to be a chest equivalent for Shoal. No, I can't say what it would be, but I can guess what the boss is. So in Shoal, you fight Satan Man, right? And the Cathedral, you fight Isaac. And then if you go get the Polaroid thing, you go to the chest and fight Blue Baby. Notice how Blue Baby is almost the same as Isaac. I mean, yes, he's slightly harder than Isaac, but he's still basically the same. So character-wise, they're kind of the opposite, but still somehow the same. So taking that information, we can conclude that after you beat Satan, you must fight something that looks similar, but at the same time is the opposite of him. Anything comes to mind? Well, let's look at the Devil Room. Okay, stop that. So what is the alternative of that, then? The Angel Room. So, logically... Okay, you're smart. You can figure it out by yourself. Also, the chest equivalent might just be Purgatory. You know, the place that was made to get cleaned of your sins. The, the reason Isaac's mom is trying to... You know... Wait, does this mean I technically lied in the beginning of this one? Um... NEXT! With Wrath of the Land giving alternative twists to something, my guess is that Rebirth will do the same. There will be new pickups, at least one for every coin, key, bomb, card, all that good stuff. So this is just for the key pickup. So here's a key prediction. That sounds really stupid. Perhaps a double key pickup, kind of like the one plus one free bomb thing. Or maybe a keychain that gives multiple keys. Speaking of alternate things, I did some rapid guessing for beggars. Here, have the picture then. Okay, that's enough looking. Next! That there is a teaser picture of a boss called The Haunt. So let me just see here. Hmm. Obviously, there's the Isaac comparison. He's probably some kind of ghost that's surrounded by baby-looking things. Perhaps they are there to protect him. A halo of flies, if you will. Also, as suggested by how big he is, he kinda looks like the Duke. Or, so this might be the Duke's ghost. Or perhaps he's just an entirely new monster. I don't know, do I look like the Maya Calendar or Nostradamus? Guess not. Next! Recently, a new enemy was teased. He is called Fatty, and he has a very gluttony thing going on with him. Perhaps he's a weak version of him. Well, that's unlikely, since this is already a weak version of Gluttony. But by his bleeding eyes, I can only assume he's a fat gapper. So my guess is, by looking at the effects of the Bucket of Lard, he's probably a gapper that's slower but has more HP. Or I may be way off, as stated multiple times in this video. NEXT! So, um... Dingle. That's a... A boss. Might as well, I mean, I mean, we hate the poop as an item, so might as well make him into a monster so we can target our hate at something. I can't conclude much from looking at this, really. My guess is it he shits everywhere to defend himself and just kind of behaves like a monster. By the way, if he gets one hit killed by toilet paper, I called it first. Just saying. Actually, never mind, that's kind of dumb. Next! Last thing on the list, I, I swear, Edwin has once mentioned my flyout video or video series and said that there might be an item based off it. Now in a later interview he said he might have scrapped that because he can't really make a reference to everything his fans ever made about Isaac. Only some will be salvaged. Furthermore, I do not know what the item is. I don't know its name, I don't know its effects, I don't know how it's called, I don't know its description, I don't know what's its favorite food, so please stop asking. But some people have started a theory that, if it will be an Isaac, it might be called Little Duke, in which the description is, Little Duke. So people thought was most likely that 
will happen is that he's a familiar that spawns those blue kamikaze flies when there are enemies in the room. Then again, he could do anything, cause he's Duke. I'm also not praising myself for making a fly out. Don't, don't, don't get me wrong, I just may have for fun, not attention. So that's about everything I can think of for Rebirth. Again, do not take me wrong, these things will probably not be in the game. What you could do is go to the Binding Eye of Isaac wiki and look up details for Rebirth for all the things that definitely will be in the game. Yes, I am advertising the wiki. How did you notice? My marketing skills were superb. They were better than Greed's. Okay, I'll stop being an ass now. Have a nice day.